first thing is the Mario Badescu the skincare facial spray with aloe, cucumber, and green tea. I really enjoyed this a lot. Um, I went and purchased a bigger bottle, so that was something that I would use again. And I've tried these 24 karat gold retinol under eye pads, anti-aging. And I purchased these from Burlington for $3.99. I've actually used two pairs. I gave one to my mom and then I put two in my giveaway. So I'll probably be going back and looking for these again. And this is uh, the Deep Sea Cosmetics Men's Moisturizing Cleansing Gel. I really love the way this smells. It's kind of got a, um, a cologne or perfumey scent to it. And it reminds me of the Jean-Paul Gaultier. This cologne here. If you guys have never heard of it, Jean-Paul Gaultier. Oh, I love it. It's such a clean, fresh scent. And the next thing is my skincare products. Um, went through this Charcoal Rescue Mask by Dermalogica. I believe this was like $45 a tube. I will not be buying this again just because it didn't last that long. I've only used it probably a couple handfuls of times. I try to use it about once every week. And so I started using it at the beginning of January and it lasted me about three months. So I guess that's kind of okay but um, it didn't seem to really help a lot I do have another one that I use um, it's called a super foliant and it's also by Dermalogica it's in a powder form you just mix it into your hand and kinda use it as as an exfoliant to um, remove the dead skin cells so I like that one um, I do have other facial masks that I use so next thing is the special cleansing gel by Dermalogica also I really love this. If you guys haven't seen my previous videos, um, you can check them out. I have, I'll try to link it down below or up here. I'll figure out how to do that, hopefully. But I really love this special cleansing gel. I did purchase another one. I believe it was $38. I haven't opened it yet, but I love it that much. It's a soap-free product, so it's not going to dry your skin out. And I really love the way that it makes my skin feel. And then after I cleanse with that, I use this multi-active toner, and this is my empty. I also have a new one that I had purchased. This was only $12. It's a little bit smaller. It comes in 1.7 fluid ounces, but it does last a long time. Just about one sprit on each side of the face. And the next thing, um, this came in one of my free, it was a free item that I had received. It's called Sound sleep cocoon and it had a lavender scent to it and it actually gave me some pretty weird dreams um, I didn't know this but my mom had brought it to my attention that lavender tends to give some people dreams and it just happened to give me some weird dreams so I don't know if it helped me sleep better or not but um, I'll have to try that again maybe the next thing was this uh, I had a little tiny sampler like this from Sephora. This was the Drunk Elephant Sea Tango. And I don't like know if I liked it that much. Um, maybe I'll get another sample and try it out. But I'm actually trying out the Mirad Retinol Youth Eye Cream right now. So that's what that was. Another thing I went through was the Bliss uh, Triple Oxygen Radiant Protection Energizing Serum. I do not know how much was in this container, but I just started using it last month, and it it seemed to be okay. It had a really nice scent to it. It was like a um, citrusy lemon. I actually really enjoyed it, but I don't know if I'll be purchasing that again. I'll let you guys know if I do. And then this Claude uh, Vino Source Cream Sorbet Hydrant. Moisturizing Sorbet. It was just like a lotion. I had got this for my birthday gift from Sephora along with this little oil that came with it and I'm just about out of that. The Vino Perfect. It's a little bit of oily. I wouldn't recommend this if you have oily skin but I do use it when I tend to be drying out a little. So I, I won't be repurchasing that but I did really enjoy it. Another thing was this, I believe it was the Pericome MD, 
and it was the photo finish. I had it for a while, I cleaned out the jar, but it had a really strong scent to it. Um, I'd say it kind of smelt like a paint or actually white out is what it reminded me of. I asked my friend if he thought that it smelt like it was harsh or chemically, like a chemical smell to it. But he said he liked it. It was nice and clean to him. He said it reminded him of a clean, like a clean space. So another thing I went through was these clear eyes, maximum itchy eye relief. I tend to use this before I do any of my looks. Just a little tiny bit in each eye. It helps them from getting too red. I do have sensitive eyes, so it seemed to help a little bit. I do use this uh, regularly, but I won't be purchasing that one again. Right now I'm using this little tiny Visine. So, and the last few things is just a small little hair care products. Um, these are from Washington State at Tulalip uh, Hotel, Casino and Resort. And I actually like the hotel uh, soaps and shampoos just because they're super tiny. And I usually bring my own, but when we get there, I bring them back home. <laughs> I know it sounds a little crazy, but I just enjoy them a lot. Um, had a nice, fresh, clean scent to it. And then my last item that I had went through for my March empties, April empties, sorry, was this Deep Sport Endurance Styling Gel. So it was just one thing that I used uh, through my hair. And I won't be using this again because I had purchased, let's see if I have it here. I had purchased the Style Sexy Hair. Sorry, I don't think I have it. Yeah, it's in my room, I believe. Let me see, I'll be right back. Here it is. This is the Style Sexy Hair. Hard Up. Level 9 shine, level 10 hold. I really like this because it gives me that crunchy feel. That's just one of the things I go for. I don't like anything to get blown out of place. So, <laughs> you and your dirty minds. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate all your love and support. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. And if you'd like to see how I created this look today, stay tuned for my next video and I'll show you how I did my shadows and what products I used. And also, um, if you haven't noticed in any of my other previous videos, I do link down below all the, all the products that I've used and they are magic links. So they are affiliate. I do get a small tiny percentage if you do choose to purchase through those links. But go ahead and check them out. Um, I really appreciate it once again. Thank you all for your love and support and we'll see you in the next one.